What's up guys, this is Leland coming at you from beautiful California. I want to make a quick video on why taking action right now in your business and or life or opportunities around you is the best thing you can do. Okay, at the end of this video, you will now know, you will be more conscious why in that moment, at that time, why taking action is simply the best thing for you. Check this out. Okay, first thing, get off the couch and get away from the TV. When we get off the couch and when we get away from the TV, our mind, you know, we start asking ourselves in our mind and in our heads, like, hey, where are my greatest opportunities now? What do I need to be focusing on? Maybe I have a school project that I got to finish. Maybe I have some stuff online for my business that I have to do. Maybe there's something technical that I have to do, or maybe there's something I need, I need to go reach out somewhere down the street or perhaps in a different city or whatever the case is. Get away from the couch and get away from the TV. Okay, second thing. Once we just simply take action now, it's going to open the door of opportunity and increase the opportunity, guys. Whenever we just, you know, I'm just going to go out there. Maybe you need a job. Maybe you're looking for a, a, some sort of business business to start. Maybe you're looking for make money online opportunities. Maybe you're looking for something to do, you know, some uh, sort of activity you could do after school or maybe uh, during the summer, maybe during the fall, or maybe there's some sort of outreach that you want to be a part of. Well, you, you, have, you have to simply just go take action, and then that's going to open the door of opportunity, and the opportunity is going to come in and say, hey, what do you want to do? Then after that, obviously, take action on one of those things, and, you know, obviously use your filter, you know, you know, uh, pray to God, talk with God about it, and choose the right thing, but by simply taking action, that's going to help you open the door of opportunity, and then also increase that opportunity, which is awesome. Three, poverty won't come upon you if you simply just take action. And I have a Bible verse I want to read right here. Okay, this is out of Proverbs 6, uh, verses 9 through 11. How long will you lie there, O sluggard? When will you arise from your sleep? A little sleep, a little slumber, a little folding of the hands to rest, and poverty will come upon you like a robber and want like an armed man. So what is this? This is showing that, hey, you simply need to take action because when you're lazy, poverty, the world bills are going to pile up on you and they're going to overcome you. And that's why you need to consistently be taking action so you can shoot through those and pay your bills and reach your goals and really have that manifest itself in your life. Fourth thing, don't be a parked car. You know, you have to be a moving car, guys. You know, when, you know, in the Bible... You know, when uh, the, God was taking the Israelites to the promised land, they had to move. They couldn't They couldn't just sit there. They couldn't just stand there. You know, some of them were lazy and said, Why, God, why can't you just pick us up and put us in the promised land? But God wanted them to move. You know, God has great things for all of us, but we have to get out of our complacency, you know, walk away from sin, you know, and, and step into this, this new life in Jesus Christ. You know, this new life in the universe, whatever it is for you. And... And you know, once again, back to the back to the video. Simply taking action, you know, be a moving car. You know, like God, you know, like the universe doesn't like to work with a parked car. So you need to be moving consistently, guys. Taking action every day. Fifth thing, you know, once you start taking action, you'll soon find out that your skill or things you need. You're going to find out the opportunities to sharpen those because once we start taking action, I'm going to find out, oh, maybe I need to learn this. Or maybe, oh, I'm pretty good at this, but this actually needs to be a little sharper so I can be more successful in whatever I'm trying to do. So those are the five things to review real fast. This is why taking action now in your life and or business or anything else, any opportunities around you is the number one best thing you can do. Why? Because it's going to open the door of opportunity. It's going to increase the opportunity. Poverty is not going to come upon you. And you're going to be a moving car, so the opportunities are going to come about. And you'll soon find out what you need to learn or what you need to do or what you need to sharpen or what needs to happen in order for you to get to your clear goals that you have set. And if you haven't set clear goals, that is the number one thing you need to do right now. And sometimes taking action is simply to take no action in the sense that maybe instead of all this overwhelming information around me, maybe I simply just need to take the action and first pray to God and ask God for wisdom. Because in James 1 of the Bible, God says, the Bible says, you know, 
anybody that prays to God and asks for wisdom, he doesn't rebuke them. He doesn't say, hey, you're an idiot. Don't ask me for wisdom. He says, no, thank you for asking me. Let me share with you some wisdom. So guys, consistently pray, consistently take action, and you guys make it an awesome day. And this is exactly why you need to take action right now in your life and or business. God bless, guys. Make it an awesome day. We'll talk soon. Bye.